Today's video is sponsored by this young upcoming hip-hop artist. Open your clip in the Fusion page. Bring a lens blur node after your clip, at the moment you have this basic blur effect. I'm not sure if his is only in the studio version, if you're in the free version and you don't have it. That's not my problem. If you go to the shape type, and change it to external input, you will end up with an empty image. Bring a background node in empty space, and change the color to white. Add a mask node on it, and make your random shape. Connect the background node to the green point of the lens blur. With the lens blur node selected, bring down the scale slider, and you will start to see the difference in the blur pattern. You can play around with the sliders and pretend that you know what you are doing, but the magic is happening in the rotation slider. You can manually animate it, or you can right click on it, and select to modify it with the shape modifier. Go to the Modifiers tab, bring down the Smoothness slider, set the minimum to minus 180, and the maximum slider to 180. Now you have this nice effect happening, you can use a Depth Map node or a Magic Mask to isolate the subject. Bring a Magic Mask node in empty space, connect your clip to this, and drag it to the left viewer. Add few points into your subject, and hit the Track Forward button. Once your mask is ready, add a Saver node after, choose a destination to save it, Go to the Fusion menu, and select to render all savers. Delete the mask, bring a loader node and choose your saved file. Add a bitmap node in empty space, and connect your mask to the yellow point of the bitmap. Check the invert box, and connect this to the blue point of the lens blur. Now you can go to the lens blur and play around with the sliders. If you are looking for some more creative effects, buy my pack so I can never work again.